Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Toya from Planning and Teaching and today is another plan with me in my mini edition happy planner. Um, I absolutely love, love the sugar and spice planner. I really wish that I would have gotten the, the classic size sugar and spice, but you live and you learn, right? So we are currently in March. If you did not see that plan with me that I did last week, I did a real quick run through. If you guys have not seen it, go check it out. I will leave a link here. Go click on that card after you watch this video. You can click down below in the description box. Um, and I absolutely loved how it turned out. It was featuring um, Zona Paperese, um Saturday samplers, and I think I still have the one I use. I do, but I don't know the name of it, so don't quote me on it. So anyway, this is the Saturday sampler that I used last week. As you can see, I used lots of things. Um, there's still some things that I didn't use, and I may utilize that this week, or might not. Just depends. So all right guys so this week is st patrick's day and i wanted to do just a green theme but i ended up not doing it because there wasn't enough um four leaf clovers i actually ordered a kit offline that was printable but um as you guys know i'm moving and the printer's not set up yet so i didn't have the opportunity to um get my kit done as well as get it cut out so if i don't use it um shortly then i'll end up using it probably next year because you know stickers don't, don't get old so i ended up using um some sticker sheets just from an old sticker book that's already loose i'm going to end up combining those into a whole sticker book just so it won't be out and about but um i know i have the mini and it has this same sheet in there but it's a full box but i wanted to go ahead and use some of these loose stickers that i had so I ended up using that really pretty floral pattern as well as um, that wear green sticker and it has some gold trim. And then I went into my dates and holidays sticker book and pulled the St. Patrick's Day in that green color. Um, and so right now I was just kind of flipping through and see if I can find anything that I wanted to use. Something new this week that I wanted to do um, and I thank Mom Run Craft for this is just identify um, what the weather's going to be like. Yes, there are some smaller icons in the mini sticker books, but like I said, I wanted to use my loose sheets. I also wanted to go in and put down the um, the weather, what the high is supposed to be, just so when I glance down in my planner, I will know how to dress me and my son uh, when we go when we are going out and about. So at this point, I'm just looking for a great sticker to put down there at the bottom for word of the week. And I ended up falling in love with this love big and it ends up being the same color. So I chose that. I also chose to match the sticker um, from the mini sticker book with that little bitty box and added in that green coffee because who doesn't need coffee on Monday, right? So then I ended up putting in some pops of yellow and green. I picked these yellow flowers from the Today is the Day sticker book. I absolutely love how it turned out. So um, this is more of a springy theme than it is um, a St. Patrick's Day theme, which is what I intended to go with. So I just kind of let, um, let this plan with me work out on its own and I love the way it turned out. So as you can see, I'm just putting different pieces, different places, any pieces that are hanging off, I just add those on. I was going to use a checklist from here um, from the little bitty short sheet from my seasonal um, teacher planner insert, but I did not want to use it because it was too big. So I ended up going to my mini seasonal and I was looking for yellow, but I couldn't find it. So I ended up using this really pretty blue and green and that worked really well with the um, box that I chose. And then I was looking for a lunch date sticker and I could not find it. I'm sure there's one, but I couldn't find it. So then I just chose to use a habit tracker from my Zona Papery um, purchase as well as a Target Run sticker, a Study Sesh sticker, and some Scrub-A-Dub cleaning stickers to indicate the days that I plan on cleaning, studying, and going to Target. I absolutely love my Zona Paper repurchases. If you have not seen that video, guys, the link is in the description bar or the card is at the beginning of the video. So I really zoomed in on this, guys, and my hand is in the way for a lot of this, but I'm just planning out my week, all the things that I intend to do. And I like to just leave one space blank 
one to two spaces blank so that I can include different things as the week progresses. Okay guys, so the last thing I was doing is pulling out an appointment sticker for lunch with my husband on Friday. And I also included um, one of the books from my um, faith sticker roll. I have lost my faith sticker book, so I had to use that. So thanks so much for watching guys. Keep God first in everything you do. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up, click that subscribe button. And as always, happy planning and teaching you guys.